Hello everyone, welcome to my Laravel e-commerce project. In this video, I want to show you how we can list our data in admin panel. When we add any data, after, after insert data, we need to go to list uh, page in this array. For that, we need to add return redirect return redirect and path As, and root any root that we can list our category we can define like this science Okay. And it sent to us with the return right redirect to at the category list. You see. I want to show my I want to list my category right here. For this I need to open my admin template because I need the I need tables simple table I need the simple table which one is very simple I think it's good and inspect border table copy element we see cart and cart header we copy cart header at index we have a cart reader something yes yes we can I can paste not I need to copy the whole card okay okay it is good I need to change something from here category list home admin And I have either I can say ID title
maybe image and also at the right side we need the edit and delete Not sure maybe we can show data also okay Okay, title keyword this image delete that okay. I want to delete another rows. Okay, it's good. We need to get our category data and list in this area how we can do this oh how we can get data from database we need the eloquent things with this framework about everything about model we can use in this area for example you can find a lot of information that how you can get data from database and do something on the database loops and queries as you can see we can get data like this where is the my index yes It's not flight, of course. Category. We need to send this data. this and sorry we need to define like this okay we get data from the category all data also at the future we can uh, create our specific queries in this area or queries but now I get all of data from the category I sent this data to my index my index blade I need to create for each dollar data as record set
and and for each we need to define like this record set and id Okay, title keywords description image status, but here we need to create a link a like this Okay, as you can see, we listed all of data and we have edit, delete and show. Of course we don't need to add this. Edit, delete, show. But I want to. I want. I don't want to use this like simple uh, link. I want to uh, show. I want to use button instead of the text. We have a button. User interface elements. You see, I think it's good. Small button, button X small, flat. It is good. Inspect. I want to just take I want to just take class You see, it is but instead of the it is it's better than the text. 
I want to apply the same thing in this area. I know my this info the another I think is button danger the red one is button danger and this is button success okay we can change small small x like that okay as you can see we get data from database we get data from the database from the model this mvc is working right in this function now is mvc is working how is working we called index function it's root from ro the root we access the controller controller x the model access to model and get data from the model and we send this data to the index area and at the index we created a loop we defined before we defined our headers then we created a loop in this loop we list all of our data in the table in this case you know you have to know something basic information about the table what is tr what is th what is td what is tr you have to know tr is row td is column that's why we add all of this tr this row in our loop and we access all of data with the RS record set short name of the record set record set and field of the category okay thank you for watching see you the next video